friends welcome back to my channel i'm so happy to have you guys here today we are getting this back patio clean and decorated for the summer and i am so excited to share this video with you guys so i hope you guys continue to stay tuned watch hope you enjoy and i hope you enjoy so much that you will hit that subscribe button as well as a like share comment and the notification bell because you want to make sure you got that bell clicked so whenever I post a video you will be notified. I do want to remind you guys because I am now in my third trimester and I am super exhausted. I will only be giving you guys one video a week every Sunday so make sure you guys look out for my videos on Sundays at 10 a.m. Uh, Central Standard Time. I always get that confused. But with this video, guys, you will see my boys helping my husband a lot. You'll see me helping as well. So I won't be doing much talking in the first and the second half of this video because your girl will be running her mouth at the end of this video. So I hope you guys can uh, continue to watch and enjoy. For some reason, I feel like I can't talk. And then I feel a bit out of breath. But I hope you guys continue to watch and continue to enjoy. And I also want to introduce myself to all my newcomers. If you are watching this video and this is the first time watching any of my videos, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Hope you love it enough to hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell. Don't forget to like and share with your friends and family. And I hope you guys come back for more. And to my holdies but my goodies, welcome back. I'm so happy to have you here. Thank you again for watching. And I hope you guys are enjoying. And for you amazing folks that come back every week and watch my video and still haven't subscribed. I don't know what you're waiting on because obviously you love it enough to keep watching my videos. So I'm going to need you to hit that subscribe button and show your girl some love. Again, thank you guys. Let me be quiet so you guys can enjoy this video. So let's get back to some cleaning. Let me tell you, these lights was pretty much just stressing me out because we could not figure out how we really wanted them. And every way we tried, we figured they would just not work. It rained for 10 days straight. So by the time we went outside, every single light was on the floor. So we were definitely trying to figure out different ways to put it. And I will tell you guys later if you keep on watching what our plan was unfortunately we never did it in this video because y'all my husband been really tired he's been helping me get ready for baby because i am in my nesting mode so we're just we've just been enjoying the backyard we haven't been doing anything else we still have a few more stuff to do but we aren't really worried about it quite hard, quite lovely. You start me up like
My husband was putting up the lights and he didn't realize that right where he was standing, there was a bee nest. So that's what you guys see him spraying. It is like you set me free. Chasing heights to stay alive. But if I'm with you, I'll survive. So guys we tried to hang the lights up there but it's metal and no matter what my husband was doing it wasn't working so let me show you what we decided to do so we're gonna take down all the lights that you see up here the lights that are over there we're, we're gonna remove them all and just add them to the side of the fence and then all the way to the back of the fence because then I was thinking we have light up here and the light goes as far as to the trees but then from the trees there's no light down at the back fence so we're just gonna hang up all the lights and that way we'll have light back there so that is what my husband is doing now guys this has been harder than we thought and then it rained for like two weeks and then it rained um night before last so the backyard is still wet and soggy so yeah that's our struggle that we're dealing with right now so i did have a rug here if you guys saw that in a previous clip but because it rained 10 days straight and yes guys i mean 10 days straight no cooling off period the rug got really really wet so I had to put it aside for it to dry and I had already bought a second one so I decided to put it down so that I could have my husband put the bench on here. So this is the rug that was there before and we moved it over along with the table. Don't treat me like a stranger, you give me motivation, make my life vacation, when we are together I surrender.
flex Dance to the rhythm and you do all the rest Oh girl, na na Oh girl, na na cushions that I put on the bench were a complete fail. I bought them from Dollar General thinking that they would fit the bench but because the bench was still in the box and I didn't know how it looked before my husband put it together I bought these thinking they would fit on there. Nope they didn't work. All my worries disappear yeah it's all because of Hey guys, so welcome to my backyard. I wanted to show you guys the final look of our patio decor. I am satisfied with the final look and we've definitely been enjoying ourselves back here <laughs> as you can see my baby is right <laughs> at the window because he wants to come outside but I'm trying to get this film before I let the boys outside plus it's kind of really hot so I'm trying to hurry up and get this done I've been trying to get this done guys for about a month now <laughs> but it's been raining a lot and we've been enjoying it our time out here so much that it keep getting messed up so I was like let me hurry up and just get this done so I just want to show you guys everything I have this bird bath and I bought this um, water thingy I don't even know what it's called but I got it from Amazon and I will definitely link it it's not too sunny out right now the sun is not completely out so the sun is not getting it the way it's supposed to it works um, it's a solar yeah it's solar something <laughs> so once the sun hits it then the water shoots up as you can see it's trying to shoot up right now and the birds absolutely love it uh, we have our koi pond over here. It's a bit dirty right now because um, my husband cleaned it out, but we got our yard cut over the weekend and it got dirty. So it's very filthy. We were talking about getting fish for it, but it never stays clean long enough for us to even think about getting fish to put in there. And we feel like they probably would die anyway. So if you guys remember um, at the beginning of this video we were putting up some lights well <laughs> as you can see they are no longer out there because it was raining so hard that they all fell down so our goal was to put the lights up up there and just connect it to the fence and carry it all the way to the back because right at the 
tree right here is where our light stops so when we turn on the outside light right there it shines all the way to this tree and then it stops so we were thinking to put the lights all the way because we have enough and just connect them all the way up here so that they will connect to the connector plug down here and that way we will have lights hope I'm not <laughs> <laughs> giving you guys a headache turning so much but guys we absolutely love how big our backyard is the boys enjoy playing out here they haven't played in the grass yet but I plan to get them a bouncy house and I don't know where our balls like the football um, the soccer ball is at so they can like play in the grass but I'm definitely gonna try to find that as you can see the boys are trying to call me because <laughs> they want to come out here so but it's too hot so i'm trying to hurry up and get this done so this table was already here when we moved in so all i did was buy these chairs from walmart and i paid i believe between four to six dollars per chair which is a good deal like i said i wanted to do this on a budget that was affordable for our pockets guys we just moved into this house and we've bought so many things so i definitely wanted it to be budget friendly these dishes and cups i had from our previous house and i only had two and there is no more at the store so we're just working with that it's just me and my husband anyway so we don't need extra but that's our little eating area whenever we bring the boys out to swim they just sit around this table and have their snack um, over here we have our my husband grill as you can see it's covered so it will stay protected I don't know why my husband turned this table over but <laughs> I can't explain that to you and that is our pool we had it out yesterday for the boys to swim and they have their slide my son my toddler my four-year-old he calls this the park and then we have a little water station over here that they like to play with over here we have the fire pit we haven't used it yet but we do store our candles in there that my husband lights whenever we come outside we haven't used it yet because um, I just found firewood over the weekend, but we've really been using it to store our candles whenever it gets like a lot of bugs out here, the mosquitoes. My husband lights this up and we use that. I let the boys out, so now they're fussing. So if you hear them, just ignore them. <laughs> so I bought these two chairs from Walmart as well. I wanted a pop of color, and I believe I paid like nine dollars for these. But I cannot wait to start using the fire pit as well as making marshmallows for the boys. I do have all that stuff inside. I'm just waiting for my husband to light that wood so we can make marshmallows but we've definitely been enjoying it out here back here we have our hose don't even worry about that it's messy as always because i don't know how to wrap it up correctly and i'm not gonna struggle we got a trash can and then i got this storage drawer out here it has the towels that we use whenever the boys are in the pool some white beaters for them to put on when they want to go in the pool and their pool shorts and also diapers for my baby over here we have like a little storage little caddy a little bar area as i call it but right now it is a <laughs> disaster because everything is just thrown back there you can see all the lights this mirror actually is supposed to be painted to put in my room my husband is gonna eventually take care of that but that area is a total mess i do plan to get it clean but half the time guys it's like super hot out here 
and it's hard for me to stay out here long enough to do any kind of cleaning but I do have a little decor on top I've had this from the previous house I got some candles I got these shells from Dollar General and these flowers were already here so I just left them as is and then these flowers I got from Family Dollar you saw some in my previous video of my front porch I also got some for the back and then this I don't know what it is a flower or something like that I got at um, Dollar General the LO summer sign I got from Dollar Tree and I do have another flower over here this came with the house but we haven't used it yet but um, it does need to be clean you guys can see it's very dirty but my husband has to clean that because it's too dusty for me I have asthma so I still have to be careful when it comes to dust and as you can see we have our heavy duty fan out here so whenever the boys are swimming I just sit right in front of it and they just have a jolly good time and then we have our mat that says welcome to our place I actually got that from Dollar General over here is definitely one of my favorite hangout spots to just chill on a nice Sunday morning and have me a cup of tea I got this plant from at home the other one over there I got from at home as well they were on discount sorry if noise in the background it's disturbing you guys my boys are always fussing at each other um, I got the bench from Walmart as well as the pillows and they said home sweet home with the pillows I wanted to blend in the red with the flowers along with these chairs over here so as you can see I did want a color palette but I definitely wanted bright colors because I love bright colors the table was actually here at this house when we first got here the landlord asked, up, asked us if we wanted to keep it so we told her yes and I eventually immediately knew exactly what I wanted to do with it and it's perfect out here our little hangout spot and then I got these two chairs for the boys at uh, Walmart I actually wanted two blue but they were sold out so they gave me one blue and one red and the centerpiece I got from Dollar General along with the candle so this is our little outdoor oasis we've been enjoying it my husband has been getting some um, mulch we got some red mulch to put right there and we got some black mulch as well to put down here we were gonna get rocks and then we were thinking of getting bricks but then we were like this is not our house so we don't wanna you know be spending too much so we put some mulch right here and you're probably why wondering why but if you can see there is absolutely barely any grass right here and then this section is so low that it dips if you can see right here it actually dips down so whenever it rains the water flows down this way settles right here and comes all the way up on the patio so we got the mulch to help with that so far it's been good uh, we do plan to get some more mulch so i hope you guys enjoy this video as i clean and decorated my back patio like i said we absolutely love this place we love how big everything is and we've definitely been enjoying ourselves back here on the weekends and sometimes during the week i'll bring the boys out and we just hang out 
but I cannot wait to start using that fire pit. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. Make sure you leave me a comment as well. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Mom. Closer than before, but I want you close.